Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be playing some Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands. Uh, what I'm going to be doing here today is telling you all how to unlock the Desert Eagle or the D50 uh, pistol in Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands. So the first thing you're going to need to do, click M on your keyboard or the pause button on your controller, go to your map. Then you go, you zoom out if you want to, then you go all the way over here to Libertad, it's the bottom right corner of the map. Then you go, no, not too much, not too much, not too much, and then you go right around to the edge of the border on the top left side of the, the map, and you go to this military base looking place right here. It's got these four buildings in a row here, four buildings in a row here, these two large ones, and it's kind of, it looks like this, so if you go there, Place your beacon, place your marker, whatever you want to call it. And now you have a path from wherever you start on the map to over there. Or if you start in Libertad, then there you go. So now you have to travel all the way over there. And then you have to go. Okay, mister, you are the most annoying person I've ever seen. Mission failed. We'll get him next time. So, here we are about one kilometer away, but we're in a helicopter from the base. We're about to land and experience what this place is actually like. Let's just give some threatening shots to them from my miniguns. Jesus Christ. Put me down. Put me down. Fast. Quickly. Faster. Run. <laughs> ah! This place is scary. Oh, Jesus, there's airstrikes or mortars, whatever. Oh, hey. Uh, this should be it right here, if I, if I say so. Right? Right, please? Yeah, there we go. There is, there it is, D50. And now we can go right here. Go over here to pistols, and here it is, the D, wait, no. And there it is, the D50. Let's check it out. Yup. Yup, look at that. That's some um, that good damage, I would say, for a pistol. Uh, the rest of it's on the bit of the low side, but what can what can you say? Standard magazine. Oh wait, I can change the color. Ooh, I'll I'll change some colors around here. Change that. I like changing colors of things. Paint presets. Oh, you can change the colors. I never actually knew this. Uh, day of the skull. No, woodland blue. Yeah. Perfect, perfect. Don't don't mind the rest of the loadout. All right, so we're gonna use it a little bit at the base while we try to defend ourselves for as long as possible. Oh god, man down. Now this is just me playing around trying to kill people. Oh, look at those iron sights. That's so beautiful. Ooh. Oh, ha ha! Two shot to armored enemies. Oh god. Oh god. Ah no! They found me. Teammates, can you like come help? Thanks. Uh, there's one of you still alive, I think. Never mind. They uh, they all died. Okay, so we respawn now that we're in a nice peaceful environment. We can take a look at the pistol here in third person. Uh, it's it looks humongous, just like the Jackdaw pistol, which is the Assassin's Creed pistol. It's got seven bullets. We got semi-auto. We can have the over-the-shoulder view. It looks interesting. The crosshair is tiny. You can fire it fairly fast. And it, it's pretty epic. And it's probably one of the best pistols you can have. Ultimate range test. Oh my god. One tap. Okay, guys. So this is where I'm going to end the video off today. Even though my teammates are probably going to revive me right now. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this little tutorial on how to find and acquire the Desert Eagle in Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands. I do sincerely hope that you guys enjoyed, because this game is real fun for me to play. Die! Thank you. Ooh, got an action completed. So, I hope you guys enjoyed th this little gameplay here of me using the pistol, and of the finding, acquiring, whatever of the pistol. It's pretty good. Don't mind me. I just suck at the game. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe to the channel if you want to. And I'll see you guys in another video. Peace.